Hi ladies, today I will be reviewing my LV Monogram wallet after 8 years of usage and we will look into the wear and tear of this canvas coated SLG and come to a conclusion if Louis Vuitton is worth its value. My name is Loki and I am a luxury YouTuber who enjoys and appreciates all things luxury from vintage to pre-love and brand new. I am a huge lover of pre-love and vintage and will occasionally drop little tips and tricks when purchasing pre-love. So if you are new to my channel, do consider subscribing and I will definitely welcome you into my family. If you are already part of my family, thank you again for coming back and supporting. I appreciate any comments, love, kisses and encouragement and positive vibes of course. Without further ado, let's get started. So this is my well-used and not abused LV Monogram Cout Long Bifold Wallet in Coated Canvas and I purchased this pre-loved about 8 years ago. I was after a card holder and a wallet to store my cash at that time. As usual, I prefer to keep my notes straight, hence a long wallet was something I was after. I have used and thrown a few other wallets before, like those combined with a coin compartment, but I felt those were a bit too bulky for me. I also used to own a few wallets that had the zipper uh, around the entire wallet, but on hindsight, I found those required too much hand coordination for me. Hence, my solution was this bifold wallet, which opens up just like this, and easy access to my cards and my cash. So ever since I've owned this wallet, I have never changed it since. Now let's have a look at the compartments in this wallet. I have removed all my cards and my cash. And as you can see, this wallet is focused on cards and cash only with no coin compartments whatsoever. On this side is the Louis Vuitton stamp saying made in France. And for those of you wondering, it is, is it normal for the text to be in small letter? Although my initial thought was, shouldn't the made in France, the M, be in capital letter? Anyway, this is an authentic piece and I will show you why. On the flip side, here lies the date coat over here on the inside. And on the left side, with the LV logo embossed, it has one slot compartment. I use this for credit cards, which I use on a regular basis. And behind it lies a flap, which I use for my cash. If I flip it out a bit more, you can see the raw canvas with some coating left behind. To be honest, this happens to most vintage coated canvas like the passport holders or toiletry bags. In the last compartment behind is a closed compartment here where I stash like my vouchers or coupons that I may use when the opportunity comes. A cost from this is the 6 card holders. I do have many cards so I tend to stash about 2 cards into one slot which over time makes it bulge by quite a bit. Behind this is another closed compartment here which I stash the remainder cards like shopping cards, stamps and hair salon membership cards. Alright, so there you go. So now for the wear and tear of this wallet after 8 years. But bear in mind this is also a pre-loved wallet. Firstly, the stitching are largely intact. Let's just appreciate the regularity of the stitchings which has held up so well for the last 8 years. On the inside, still very regular. None of them have come apart. So I would say stitching wise, it's an immaculate job. Number two, the corners are slightly worn. There should be a glue to stick them together, but it comes slightly apart on close scrutiny. Not all corners are worn, but the top corners are somehow more worn than the bottom ones. So as you can tell, you can see from the side view that this is slightly starting to fray and the glue is coming apart slightly while the ones at the bottom is still largely intact. Number three, 
Overfilling the wallet with cards on one side does give that bulge which you know I prefer not to have because I find that once the slot is slightly extended it remains extended. Number four, if you look closely over here this is where the cards on this side has made the material more worn especially when I close it. Hence, the colour looks slightly more faint than it should. I mean, these are part and parcel of a pre-love, or rather I consider a vintage Louis Vuitton coated canvas wallet. Digging deeper into the card slot compartment, this is a tricky place to look, but you can see the fabric tearing on the inside. I'll just put a photo on the side. However, with all luxury items for daily use, I do expect wear after 8 years, of course. But so far, the tear has not affected the back part of the cut slot compartment like so. On the flip side, with, uh, which I have shown you before, is where I store my cash. And as you can see, the coated canvas is not so much coated anymore. Hence, giving this patchy, ugly look. On close scrutiny, you can see the raw canvas, which is the white bits here. And the brown left behind is the coating, which is slightly glossy in nature. Ultimately, this wallet cost me less than $100 and has well served its function over the last 8 years. I'm currently still using this wallet and I absolutely love this so, so much. I have browsed the Louis Vuitton website a couple of times and the closest card wallet I can find is this Brazil wallet but this has the zipper coin compartment with it. This wallet has generous 8 slot compartments on each side which I find can overload the wallet if it is completely full and packed with cards. The other good alternative is the Alexandria wallet which also has a flat zip compartment and 6 slot card holders. All in all, if I take into account the cost per wear for this wallet, I would say this is a super value for money purchase. And also considering this is from Louis Vuitton, which is a luxury brand, my conclusion is that this LV monogram canvas couch long bifold wallet is absolutely worth its value. More recently, I was still able to find this exact piece on the pre-love market for double the price which I paid for and I think it is definitely worth getting the same piece if I need a replacement wallet. So thank you for watching this review and wear and tear of this super old school LV wallet of 8 years and I appreciate your time and support coming by. I hope you enjoyed my detailed review and do subscribe and click on that notification bell for instant updates. Take care and goodbye ladies. Oh, and remember to like this video.